Hey guys, and how about we play I'm Scared? So as this is a scary game, keep in mind that it will contain sounds and our images that may be disturbing to some viewers, so if you'd rather not risk it, click off this video. If you don't mind the scares, I'm, I'm scared right now, then feel free to join me for I'm Scared. You are about to play I'm Scared. Before starting though, just make sure that the folder in the RAR file has been extracted. I did that. I'm scared needs a personal folder in order to work correctly. Press enter to continue. Go. If you didn't satisfy the request, please quit the game by pressing the escape key. If instead you have extracted the folder from the RAR file, you're free to proceed by pressing the enter key. Go. Okay, we did it, I mean. The game is about to begin. You'll need the WASD keys to move in the gaming area. I'm scared. The E key is what you need in order to interact with doors and objects. The shift key lets you run while moving. You'll need the control key to crouch. Feel free to look around with the mouse. Enter. Yeah, okay. It is important to play the game with a medium high volume. <laughs> Great. Even your headphones will serve the purpose. You need to hear certain sounds in order to go on in the game. The game will try to deceive you as many times as it can. In case something goes wrong, feel free to check the folder in order to report any error. I'm extremely sorry, I didn't really want to do that, what? Enter! Forgive me! Enter! Oh jeez. Oh, alright. That doesn't look so bad. What's this? Is that a thing on the floor? Collected a little key. Yay, I collected a little key. I'm afraid for the door. That's blood. Is this blood? That's not. Exit, okay. I need a heart in order to open. What? Where do I get a heart? Oh, how long has that been there? Okay. Scared, alright. Well? Down we go, I guess. We're going down, so. Oh, jeez. Door? Door's locked, okay. Door? Door's locked, okay. Ha ha ha, door? Yeah, you're open! Oh, books, okay. Book? No. Chair? Are you good? No. No, nothing. It. Yeah. Scared. I'm scared. Wow, for being like a low graphic game, it still gets you scared. That's kind of impressive. Good work, creator of this game. Uh, I also believe that this is indeed a longer game. So there's that. Um, are these rusted for like a reason? Whoa. Hello? Creepy. Okay, let's leave. Music stopped. Great. Now I'm gonna die, huh? Let's go to the bed. Bed of safety. Bed of safety. Get it. I'm afraid for that thing. That was a creepy thing back there. Jeez. Okay. Bookshelf. Yeah. Get, get, get. Nah. Ah. I'm scared. I really am. Jeez. Frick. Is there anything in these? In any of these? Like, no, really? Nothing? In anything? Okay. I guess we'll keep going then. Are you there? No. Hey, picture. Picture's gonna scare me later. I'm sure of it. Jump! No. Go back. Nothing? Really? Really? You still in there? No. Of course you're not, huh? Of course you're not still in there. Running! Sprinting! 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 I'm scared! I'm scared! Well, we didn't... Well, we can't go up, really? Uh, I didn't find anything there. I didn't find anything. Except for the freaky guy, and now he's gone. I don't know where. Okay, there's like nothing here to click on. What do I do? What do I do? So confused. Hey guys, and welcome back to I'm Scared. If you didn't know, um, I, I chickened out. Yeah, I did. I quit. 
So we're just gonna start this all over again. So we're gonna go over here. Open that. I feel like there should be something in here considering I had to use the little key on it, you know, but I guess not. I mean, as you saw last time, we already did that. We already looked in there and there was nothing. Um, the exit, we need a heart in order to open it, which is quite strange. There's this awesome bed. We got the key there. And then here. This is where we last were. Um, yeah, so I'm still scared playing this, by the way. Um, like, really, really scared. But I'm trying to force myself. Because I know that some of you want to see this. Others of you wouldn't care. You'd be too scared to watch, I bet. Um, oh, forgive me for that. Hopefully Skype doesn't keep acting up. But, yes. Ah, look. Look what I found. I found a rusty key. Ha ha ha. Hmm. And I heard a noise. That's great. I remember there were the cells where the one freaky guy was like back there, you know. So I'm sure I'm gonna die. You back there? Hey buddy, what's up? He's just chilling. Okay. He's cool back there, you know, like, I'll just leave him be. We'll explore back here. Yeah, I'm still scared, don't worry. I'm just totally trying to macho it up right here. Um, checking behind things for keys and stuff. Yeah, what, oh, one of the things that drives me crazy about this game in terms of, like, the scare factor is how it's so dark. Like, they're just shadows, basically, until you run into something. So if there was something scary, I wouldn't know about it until we're, like until it was like right in my face, you know? Um, someone told me, my friend told me, to look at that portrait once I leave again. Yeah, look, it's bloody. I knew it was going to change. Okay, but now that we have a key, I think we can go up the stairs. Or no, it was some. there was some other locked door, I believe, was the thing. I don't know, my friend, I told him how I quit because I got scared. And so he told me to check beyond- Oh! Okay, find the bookshelf for a key. This is weird. This doesn't seem like a normal house anymore. Okay, well, I'm gonna die now, huh? Oh! Whoa, hey, uh... Did y'all see that? Hello! Let's look that up. It's black. Oh. That's probably because, um... I looked away when it was going to take the screenshot. Yeah. And so it, uh, hmm, attention. Uh, there is a way to turn an entity into data. They have a life of their own, and it is difficult to distinguish them from normal computer files. In our actions of every day, while we sit at the computer, this byte entity observes us and studies our every move in fear. Okay, the game is simple. Following the arrows is the key. If you get caught, you lose. A sound will predict its arrival. It is whiteface. Oh, I guess I go back into the game now. Okay, I'm scared. I am, indeed. Alright, well, bring me back to the game. It's loading, okay. Ooh, that was frightening. Alright, it's sound, a sound will predict its arrival. Do you know my name? Um, yeah, you're Whiteface. Okay. Oh, look, let's play tag. Tag! You're it! Let's go this way. Okay. Well, this game does a... Um, a wonderful job, again, of being subtly terrifying. Like, wow, am I in a parking garage or something? This is kind of weird. Um, I'd appreciate... Oh, let's follow the arrow. Oh, goodness gracious! Oh, goodness gracious! Oh, my goodness! I don't know what that says. Hello! Hello, whiteface. Oh my gosh, you can hear noises. You can hear noises. Oh my gosh. Ah! ah! Following the big arrow. Screw you. Oh my gosh, you can... Oh! Oh! I saw the white face. Oh. Ah, he killed me. I got you. Oh my gosh. Slowly. What? What? Oh, this is... Ah! It communicates. It's talking to me. That's scary. I'm glad there's not like a huge jump scare when it gets you, but still. Play tag, okay. Uh, find the arrows again. 
There's an arrow. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's like the item get sound, but it's evil. Okay, so it was around here, wasn't it? Yeah, through here. The door's locked. What? Okay. I'll go this way. Still just following the arrows. I don't know any better. You can hear it. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. How do I go faster? Okay, I tried to go um, through that door it pointed out. Remember, I did. It's all help, and I'm like, I don't know how to help you. I'm dying here. Like, what do you want me to do, game? Screw the white face. Frick, okay. Um. Hmm. Um, I don't know what to do. I'm not finding any keys anywhere. Which I thought I would, you know. Where is it? Oh! Oh! Okay. It's right there. So, instead, we're gonna go this way. Oh, I, I will say, though, while it chasing you is terrifying, I'm glad it's, like, legitimately following, and it's not just, like, appearing somewhere. As soon as I say that, of course, it's gonna, like, appear, huh? Get! Get! This sounded like a good sound. Okay. Yeah! We got through the door! Haha! -ha. Oh, we did something good! We did something good! Good. Yeah, so... Oh, that's weird. Okay. Hello, darkness! Nice to see- am I just outside? On the road? Okay. I am out- Oh! Oh, hey, bud! Hey, bud! Well, I love watching you. Oh, thank you. That's what you two people say sometimes. Oh, dear. There's something wrong with the gate. What's wrong with the gate? What's wrong with the gate? Oh, there's something wrong with the gate. Not here. I think. I think it's just not showing me everything. Okay. Um, What's wrong with the gate, game? Wanna tell me? I'd love the help. Hold on, um, a picture just, you know I have dual monitors? Yeah, a picture just appeared, it opened in Chrome. That's kind of terrifying. Um, hopefully it doesn't like scream at me, I don't know if it's a GIF or not. It's not doing anything so far, but that is terrifying, how it just appeared there. What it probably was supposed to do is like, you know, once I close the game or get caught or whatever, um, that's just full screen, you know. That, however, wasn't the case. You're suffering! I'm so sorry to hear that. I would love to help you. I don't- I just don't know how, per se. Oh, that was weird. Hey, I got the gate key. There wasn't anything wrong with the gate, I just didn't have the key for it. Picture, you just gonna be there forever. On the other screen. One of them is lying. Okay, another picture appeared! That's fantastic! Oh dear. Great, so just on my other screen, um, I have the faces staring at me. That's nice. Let's not go down the pit of death. We learned not to do that in Suicide Mouse. Hello. Well, hey, it's like we're back here again. You're locked. I have a heart, don't I? Pretty sure I picked up that heart. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna go straight down the hallway to the ladder again. And go up the ladder. And then through the exit door. That's hopefully not a trap. Because if it's a trap, I at least deserve to have Admiral Akbar there to tell me so, right? Like, that's the least the game could do for me. Exit! The end. No, it's not. No, it's not. Enter. And eh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? It's not the end, is it? They said one of them is lying. 
That's bull crap. I know it's not the end. It can't be the end. But nothing clickable is working. What about escape? Yeah. <laughs> okay, did you hear that? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That's oh, okay. Um we still good? Yeah, you like the picture is still there and my and chrome. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Good, everything's still recording. Okay. Um I'm sorry and take time. Let's take time. Oh look, it's it's a him. Hello, white face. You're so cute and white. I'm sorry. Um, it's not going to let you go. I shouldn't have told you to go on. Follow my instructions. Don't let the game's appearance deceive you from now on. If things change, it arrives. Take some time and try to escape. Oh. Okay. I guess I'll start up the game again. Go. Wow, this programming is impressive to me. I mean, it might be something really simple, but having all of these, like, little triggers and everything, that's impressive to me. Wow, hey, everything is so bright and stuff. Hey, you, I know you. One, whoa, these doors have numbers on them. Aha, I got a little key, collected key one. Um, I guess I'll go through door number one then. Hello, door one. Yay. Yay. For now, the brightness is nice. The key's too far away. Hmm. Well, I could use a pillow. You've done that, right? You've, like, thrown things at other objects, like, out of your reach, you know? Like, when you're on the couch or the remote's too far away. What do you use? You use, like, a blanket or something, you know? You throw it out there and... Yeah. Frick, well, hmm. Well. Oh. Hi. That's weird. Okay, well, I can't go anywhere else, can I? No, I didn't think so. So, I need something to get that key, right? I figure, I'm just trying to, like, press E on everything. E is the activation button, if you forgot. Um, so far, no good. Oh, hey, there's a the thing. I got pincers! Yay! What's a pincer exactly? I don't know what a pincer is, but... That worked! Oh, now it's all dark. Dang it, I liked when it was bright. Was it supposed to be bright? I feel like it was, yeah, because now it's just all evil and stuff. I didn't mean to do that, really? I think you did. Now you're just regretting it. Oh! Hi, white face! Um, you, you chill there. I'm just gonna... Look at... Okay? I'm just looking at stuff. We're good? Still good, white face? Okay, I'm leaving now. Okay, well... I think I'm gonna die now. Usually this is about the time where I die- Oh look, everything's open now. Totally going to die. Um, chairs. Alright, whoa! Hey, white face! No, he's just happy right there. Which is great for me. As long as he stays happy and away from me, I'm totally cool with it, you know. I found a thing, and now I'm gonna die. It's bright again! Oh, is that good? Help me, I didn't want to die, I'm scared. Ooh, or is that I don't want to die? I'm scared too, white face. Are you just a little boy? Hmm. Well, you should stop trying to kill me. Because that's not very friendly. That's not neighborly. Oh! This is my room. Oh, cool. Yeah. Do you see how dark? Yeah, is that a noose? Yeah, I see how dark it is. It's cold. I'm sorry. You want a heater? But I can look at you. It's getting closer. You can look at me, huh? I am looking at you. I never looked away. That is how brave I am. I am scared. Yeah, but we could be friends if you want. I am scared. Oh, do you want a hug? A friendly hug that doesn't kill me? Okay. Hello, bloody floor. <laughs> Goodness gravy. Am I right or am I right? I'm right, by the way. There are noises. Okay. Oh. You're close. Oh, am I? Close to what exactly? 
Okay, well, I can't go to door six. Why did you have an arrow there if I can't even go there yet, silly? Is this a thing? No, it's just a wall with blood. Stupid blood wall. More blood. Okay, you need to find door number two. Because that's what I have the key for. Is number two? There's number two! Yay! Uh, oh, it changed. Ew. Ew. Now everything's bloody. Where are you number six? No, you're not. You're not number six. You're not even a door. God, these noises. Ah. Hello? Hello, I'm looking for room number six, please. Okay. Hey, look, it's this place. Yeah, it's like the old room. Exit. I did it. Arrow. I'm still just walking forward. This is scary. Oh, hey, white face. We're in your room again. Yay, congratulations. I won. You made it to the end. I did it. Oh, but you can't escape from, oh. Oh no, stay with, okay. Okay, I can't walk further anymore. Okay, I'm coming to hug you. I'm coming to, oh. Ah, da, da, da. Ah, da, da, da. Da, 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 da. What if I use the noose? Oh, I actually used the noose. Wow. Um, alright, goodbye. Is a picture of the noose. That's great. Um, zero. It's alive. It's real. Sorry. I'm really sorry. I didn't have any other choice. I'm scared. I don't want to die. From now on, remember this. The sound predicts its arrival. Forgive me. Okay. Well, I think that that's all that's new. So let's open up the game again to see if we're really done. Because I feel like we're not. Especially considering it said from now on. Remember. The sound predicts its arrival. Now I feel like it's going to chase me and kill me more. Which isn't good. That's never great. Exactly. Um, it, it just booted me out again. Did I do something wrong? Go. Just try launching it again. I mean, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Whether or not we beat it correctly, if it's not going to let me play anymore, I can't play anymore. No, it's just showing the same thing. It, like, blips the noose, and then it closes again. I'm not missing anything, am I? Let's see. Take time. Picture. I'm sorry. Um, we read that. Okay. Hello. It's just blackness. Got you. Slowly. Okay. Goodbye. Is the noose. Attention. Da -ba -da -ba -da. It is white face. Gotcha. And zero. Huh. Well, I'm not sure what else to do right now. Did I break the game? Was I not supposed to look at the noose? But it says goodbye and has a picture of the noose. Like, why would they have that if clicking it, like, broke the game? This is weird. This is not right. Well, even though I thought it was longer, and I still think it is longer, I'm gonna be fair to myself about this. I've tried to open it several times. It shows the noose briefly, and then it closes down again. Um, so... I don't know what to do, because, like, that's the only application. Maybe if I deleted all of the files, but I really don't want to risk that, you know? Um, then it would start over, but I don't know. Another thing is that the little thumbnail for the application is a noose. So maybe I actually did reach a valid ending. Maybe there is a better ending, but I at least reached an ending. So for now, I'm going to call it here. From what I got to play of I'm Scared. I, I thought it was a really good game, and now this is a little bit different because it's not like the usual creepypasta games I play, because those, you know, are really short, they're like specifically for creepypasta where I don't think this is, um, it's just a scary game. I think it did a really good job of building suspense at some times, and I really do like how it, um, okay, I don't necessarily like how it keeps closing the game, you have to keep reopening it, but I do really like how it adds files, um, to that document, like just that folder. And they, you know, pertain specifically to the game. Like, the game was actually communicating with you, how it took screenshots and everything. Um, I thought that, that worked out really rather well, and I thought that it was a fun aspect. 
I do think that the scares did kind of wear out a little bit because like like I said the very first time I played this I got like five minutes into it and I quit like I was really I was really scared you know um, but this time I just sat down like I'm gonna do it and really once you get once I got past that first part it was okay like once I saw what happened when I died or when like you know Whiteface was coming it was all right it wasn't nearly as scary um, now I'm sure you know like there would be other times if I did keep going in the game assuming there's more plenty of other times where I would be really scared where I would jump and it's not that I wasn't like feeling the anxiety or anything you know I was constantly like waiting for something to happen it was still scary but it wasn't like terrifying to the point where yeah I quit you know because I, I did that the first time I have to give it props too for being like a pixel game and still having that be scary and if it's not scary for you that's awesome good for you um, but it was scary for me especially the first time and the second time which is now, which, you know, and when I say first second, again, the first time I played five minutes, I was walking back toward the ladder down that hallway, hadn't found any keys or anything, um, I couldn't get up the ladder, so I quit. That was it. Um, but it was, uh, I forgot where I was going with that. Okay, well, I was talking about how it was pixel, but it was still scary. I thought they did a good job of that, and how, you know, you'd go in a room, you'd get something, you'd turn around, and the room's different, you know? Or how the text, I actually loved how the text appeared where like he was talking to you. I think it would have been more unnerving had it just been silent the entire time. But this had its own creep factor to it as well because it was like Whiteface was there, he's watching you the entire time, you know, you see him through the window and everything. And when he does talk, he even said like, you know, I'm dead, it's cold, I have to stay here, but I love watching you, I could watch you forever and whatever. And it was creepy, like it was, I really thought it was good that way. It was interesting too, getting to see a bit of that Whiteface story. How I'm still not sure exactly what, you know, was going on, but I assume that Whiteface was like a little child or something, you know? Because that's how it sounds, it sounds like a child that's scared, like legitimately scared. It talked about how it's dark, it's cold, I'm scared. There was a noose, which seems a little odd for a child because arranging a noose out of actual rope, I don't know. Um, don't try it. Like, I'm sure the children could make nooses. It was just a weird thought for me. But I liked that. I liked getting a glimpse at the monster himself at, like, in its own vulnerability. Because the monster being vulnerable, but still possessing that, like, desire to, like, watch you to keep you forever and, you know, possibly kill you or whatever. It was creepy. Like, I thought it was, at least. And so, kudos to them for that. So while it did take some mental encouragement for myself, some preparation, to actually sit down and play this game, um, I'm glad that I did. It was, it was a lot shorter than I expected, and again, I might not have finished it. If I didn't finish it, you can go ahead and tell me in the comments, Hey, you didn't finish this, and then maybe suggest what I should do, because again, I'm not sure what I could do, because I tried opening the application, you know, several times, and it just did the same thing over and over again. Flashed the noose, and then it closed again. So I don't know. But, um, for what I did play, it was, it was enjoyable in that scary, kind of like, something's gonna happen way, you know? I was, I was looking forward to keeping going, actually. I was looking forward to the end, too, to legitimately finishing it. But at the same time, it was nice actually being able to find the items to make my way through the rooms, you know, follow the arrows and everything. It was enjoyable in its own twisted way. So with all that, thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed that, and if you did, of course, feel free to have a like, comment, and if you're new, even subscribe. It means a lot, it really helps me out, and I would love to have you guys. So, tune in next time for my next video, and until then, take care.